there, Sagittarius. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl looking at October 23 through October 29. This week's planetary dance is two steps forward and one step backwards. A Mercury-Neptune trine on Tuesday, October 24 is a step in the right direction, providing easy access to your intuitive side. Sagittarians, if your job simply requires you being logical and working as an accountant or something like that, you're going to feel rather thwarted, rather pushed aside this week. However, if your job is in the marketing, creative writing or photography groove, you're going to find that things are really moving along nicely for you and you can really use your flamboyance and intuition. Mercury, Neptune trines are also great times to take off and maybe go somewhere, a day trip, or head in, jump in the car after work and just drive to the beach or drive to the mountains or a lake, whatever it is that's around you, and just enjoy and appreciate Mother Nature. Good times to continue to roll this week on Thursday, October 26, the day that sun, the sun and Jupiter, your ruler, meet up for a one-time conjunction in your past uh, renewal, subconscious and privacy please zone. Enthusiasm is high and opportunities abound. So if you start out today expecting the best, you might just get it, Sagittarius. It's time to take a step back on Friday, October 27, because that's when Venus and Pluto have another conflict and extreme feelings become the new norm. Although this Venus-Pluto square can be deeply transformative, the changes can come in the form of jealousy and manipulation both things that are not going to work out for you. So remember that. And if you start feeling jealous or you start feeling like you want to manipulate a situation, think again, Sagittarius. It's not the way for you to go. Have a great week, great speaking to you, and I do look forward to speaking to you again next week.